Welcome to Craftastrophe. Today we are going to make some little napkin holders for our upcoming holiday called Thanksgiving. And you can use it for any other holiday too. So here we go. We have a toilet paper roll and then we have some duct tape and we have some buttons. And you can use whatever kind of buttons you want and since this is for fall time, I am doing the leave buttons. So we'll take a look at those in a little bit and use them as embellishments for our napkin holders. So first we're going to cut the size that we want our napkin holders to be. So you're gonna kinda decide how big you want them. So I'm gonna make them about an inch. So you want to stab your spot and then just cut around. And you wanna make sure that you have sharp scissors that will work well with this here. You just cut around the whole entire roll and then if you have some little excess pieces, you can just cut those little pieces off. Or when you're using your duct tape or whatever you're going to use to cover the toilet paper roll, that'll kind of smooth it out a little bit too. We're done with the first step here and we have our napkin holder. So now what we're going to do is take the duct tape and you can use whatever design or color you want. And here I have splatter. So I'm going to cut a little bit of this off here. Okay. And then we're going to start in the inside and we're gonna tape it the inside part. And then we're going to go around. You just wanna make sure that the sticky stuff doesn't get stuck to the inside part until you're ready to, for it to stick. And then you're just gonna kind of overlap it a little bit as you go around. And this will take some uh, extra precision and time. You just don't wanna have too big of a, of a strip because it'll get stuck and it'll get all messed up in there. And then we're gonna find where we cut, when we, where we stopped off here. And we're going to always start from the inside, so then that way you don't have the, um, the seam on the outside. And you're going to press firmly when you like where it's positioned at. And then you're just going to go through the next set here until you get all the way around the whole entire ring. You can also use fabric or uh, whatever other kind of materials that you want to use for this. But the easiest for me is the duct tape here. So we're just going to gently duct tape this whole entire thing around. And try and not make very many bubbles in there because the bubbles will just kind of mess it up a little bit here. Okay, so we're smoothing that out as good as we can here. Looking pretty good. So we just keep making it so that it goes over to the edge. And then you have like a nice little stream of different splatters all over the place here. So we're about halfway there, so we're gonna do one more strip. And this will be good for the whole family when you have a uh, company for your uh, celebrations for whatever holiday you choose to use this for. We just need a little bit more and we'll be done with the first part of this craft here. And if you do end up with extra, you just cut it off when you're done with it. Okay, so that tucked in nicely. So we have our nice little napkin ring here. So the next step is to get your hot glue gun set up so that you can glue on your embellishment. It usually takes a few seconds for it to heat up. So we'll just wait for it to heat up for a minute and we'll get our embellishments ready. Decide which ones we want to put on here. And you can put however many you want on there. You can do whatever. You can do like small ones and big ones and all sorts of sizes and colors and whatever your heart desires. Once the hot glue gun is ready, we'll just uh, glue, put some glue onto your button that you're gonna use and then just put it wherever you wanna put it on there. 
and however many you want you can do as many as you like and I think I'll do one big one on this one just to make it have a slight little character on it okay it looks like the glue gun is ready to go so here we're gonna put our glue put a nice generous amount on there make sure that it stays and just pop it in where you want it to go just put a little pressure on it so it'll stay stuck together and there you go you have your little napkin ring ready for whatever holiday uh, plans you have and uh, enjoy thanks for watching please subscribe hit the like button uh, comment below let me have some feedback on what you think of these crafts that would be awesome thanks for watching see you next time